Hi guys, um, we're gonna connect this PS4 controller to PC. We're gonna be using wireless connection, so that will be uh, using Bluetooth. Okay, so you just turn on your Bluetooth here from your PC. You add the device, and then you press this PS button and then the share button. Now, if you press those, it will start blinking like this. Okay. Now, sometimes the PC will automatically detect it, but it will be best if you annually add it like that. Now, if you press add, it will show wireless controller input. Okay, just connect to it. There you go. Your device is ready to go. You just press done. After, with, after that, it will say setting up a device here. Now, you can open your DS4 app. There you go. Now, once you open your DS4, as you can see, it's on the list already. It's using Bluetooth. Now, battery is 0% because this controller has been used. So, it's almost drained. Oh, there you go. It turned off because it's already low back. Okay, so that's how you connect your PS4 controller. Now, um, if you want uh, to reconnect it, you just make sure that you charge it, then you turn it on. And then you, you open up your Bluetooth. It will automatically connect to it. Okay? You don't need to do it again as long as it's already here. It's already paired device. So when you turn this on, it will connect to your PC right, uh, right away. Okay? And then you can set up the profiles here from your, um, from your PS4. So that you can, if you want, you can bind or change or anything. You can do anything in your um, controller. Okay? That's it. Thank you. Thank you.